Hey everyone, in this tutorial I'm going to show you all how to adjust your custom body texture to work with the Quest Avatar. I had to combine the eyes with the body for this because there is a limit on the amount of materials you could have for Quest Avatars. So the first thing you're going to need to do is go over to Gumroad and download the Quest Body Texture Transfer. You can get that here in the Recolor Files and the Photoshop dropdown. I'm going to be using Photopea and you can look this up in the browser, it's free, but you can also use Photoshop, Krita, or whatever other program you have. So once you have this open, you're going to go on over to your custom body texture and drag that in. In Photopea, it drags it in here, I'm just going to move it out of this folder. And that's it for the body. Now you can stop here if you want, but if you have custom eyes, you're going to need to drag those in as well. So find your eye texture and drag that in. Now we need to adjust the size. So in photo P, go up here to this percentage and type in 33.8. Now we're going to adjust this by going to edit, transform, and free transform, and drag it down. This eye here is the left eye, so line that up. And then you can hit the checkbox. I'm going to move this up here so I can see better. Now we need to rasterize the layer, so right click and select rasterize. Then head over to your lasso tool and now select the right eye. Go back to edit and free transform and then drag that eye up to the right eye. Now drag this layer into this folder here and it will automatically mask out any of the extra parts. I also have a bunch of pre-made eye colors here that you can choose from. And if you want, you can also use this hue shifter to adjust any of the colors for the pre-made eyes. Also, if you changed the hearts or the stars, you can find these here. This is the white part of the eye. And here's the location for the pupils. Once you're all done editing the eyes, make sure you turn off this body UVs or you're gonna end up with lines all over your avatar. Then hit File, Export As, and I like to select PNG. So once you save that, you can put this texture in Unity and you should be ready to go. Thank you so much for watching and please let me know if you have any questions.